The first thing I do is grab one of these boxes. I'm gonna use one of these um, sign for dad. You can use a picture frame. I chose this one because it has four little holes on each side, so it would be easier to tie the string. And then go ahead and grab your hula hoop, and you're going to spray paint it in gold here. Uh, make sure when you spray paint it, um, you can spray in both sides um, for the box, like open it and spray paint it, so you will see later why I tell you. Oh, right here, because it leaves that little um color and you don't want to see that so grab your scissor and you're going to make two holes on each side so you're going to make two like that just inside and then go ahead and grab a string or whatever you have you can use a zip up tag and here better than the string but i didn't have any so i went ahead and put my hula hoop on top and i'm just going to go ahead and tie it with a string um make sure that you try one side first and then you um tie the other side so two knob you're gonna do it on each side. Then go ahead and glue. You're gonna go ahead and glue it on top, but just don't hold, don't glue it yet. Before you do that, go ahead and grab your sign and take some fish line, and you're gonna put it through the little hole just like that. Um, and then just gonna go ahead and grab some toothpick, cut it in half, and you're gonna tie it. And make sure to double knot it and tie it really good in this part because this is what's gonna hold it in place. Then once you tie it really good, you're gonna go ahead and grab your hot glue and put some all around it and then just go ahead and attach it to your frame, just like that. And you're gonna go ahead and continue doing this until you do all four sizes. Then once you're done with all four sizes, you're just going to go ahead and turn it around and just grab each line just like that and make sure to level it up and put it like all the same length. And once you level it up to make sure that it's all straight and in the same length like that. So when you flip it, it's straight. Go ahead and make a knob on top to hold it in place just like that. You see you guys? So then after you make the knob on top, then just go ahead and take your hula hoop. And this is why I tell you not to attach it yet because you're going to go ahead and put it through in the middle do you put it in the middle just go around and do like a um a few um circle like that around it split it in half the um, the string and then after you split it in half just go ahead and tie it really good in here and here you're gonna give it like a few knots like three or four so you could tie it in place then once you tie the knob in place, just go ahead and grab your scissor and then just cut the extra string that you have. Just like that, you guys. Then after you're done with that, I took the string light. I'm gonna put it inside the box and then I'm just gonna go ahead and place it all around my hula hoop. And you're gonna do that until you do it all the way to the top, like that. Then go ahead and put it in the other side as well. You're gonna do both sides. And here you can also do it in the back if you would like to do it double-sided. And just put it inside the box then go ahead and grab your flower and you're gonna place it on top make sure when you place it on top to place it in the front like I did I put it on top so you will like, just hot glue it in the front so it look look it can look better so then after you're done placing your flower on top just go ahead and grab three more flower and place it at the bottom just like that And here you can also if you want if you don't want to put cupcake at the bottom you can just fill up the box with a whole bunch of flowers and it will also look super cute and then just put the cupcake on top that's another options and this is how beautiful it looks and this is like the simple look if you don't want like to show a lot of stuff around it but if you want something more extravagant this is um you can add the balloons and more flower to it and this is how cute you guys it turned out i love that how it looks i hope you guys like it as well please comment down below and let me know what you guys think and if you guys decide to do it um tag me on the pictures um post me on my pictures and let's not forget to follow me on pinterest instagram or facebook where i do a lot of different diy as well thanks again for watching special creations by nelly